Hey, guys. Yeah, so let's solve this legal problem. Yeah, so this problem is very, I mean, very people, uh, many of people do not like it. Because I think I, I also do not like it. I think it is a stupid question. It's very, very slow, but let's still try to solve it. Okay, so uh, sentence consists of lower cases. Basically, you have a, a whatever lower cases and the digits and hyphens and uh, punctuation marks. This is uh, this one and this one, and this one. Uh, space. So basically, you have all these, and each sentence can be broken into one or more tokens separated by one of spaces. Okay. And then there is a uh, very rules. And the first rule is that the uh, valid word only contains the lower cases and hyphen, or uh, can uh, but no digits. So lead, so the first rule should be understand as no digits, and at most one hyphen. And if there is a hyphen, you need to check that this hyphen uh, is surrounded by the lower cases, right? So cannot be a dangling hyphen. And then the most one punctuation mark. If the punctuation mark exists, it must be the it must end at, at, at the ending. Okay. So three rules, and then let's go. And then also all these are okay. Okay. So uh, so for example, cat and dog, separated into three. So the answer is one, two, three. Okay. And then this is not okay. Because, because what? Because uh, the punctuation mark is at the beginning. And uh, this is not okay because I uh, should not have digits. And not okay because you should not have digits. Okay, so these are okay. And then you just return number of okay. Okay, one is not okay, okay. Uh, yeah, so six of them. Okay, so the problem is that this, this problem should be viewed as the uh, case one by one, right? So let's first split uh, your sentence in terms of this. And then you go through all the all the uh, all the words, and uh, you check where it's valid. If it's true, that means uh, we find answer. And I need to check that uh, whether uh, these words are all are all uh, forms of empathy. So I need to check this, and I end add one. Right. So basically, I need to check whether it's valid. Okay. So let's write the valid. So yeah, this is the first time I write this. Uh, problem. So maybe it's not fully optimized, but still okay. So let's define this ISA to be zero. And for uh, let's go through the array, right? So if it's if it's alpha, that means so this problem uh, this first set is that the check whether at least one alpha bit. So check uh check at least one alpha uh one uh one alpha bit. Also this problem said that, that if you at at least contain one alpha bit, right? This is important, right? Because if it's only, uh, because it cannot be, it cannot be only hyphen, it cannot be only end, right? At least need to be have at least one alpha. And if it's digits, then you don't have to do this. You don't have to check it, you just return false. So this is no digits. Okay, and for this one, if you see any guy's punctuation, then this guy should be at the final, right? So if it's not in the final, that you should return false. So this is the uh, least, uh, this is the least problem, okay. And if it's hyphen, hyphen, then the, you need to check that the uh, so if if it's hyphen, then you need to check that the query is previous, and the that uh, previous and the next should be digits, right? So if it starts at zero, that means you are you you get you get hyphen is uh, hyphen in the beginning, so it's false. If it's end, then you get false. Or uh, your previous one is not alpha bet. It's not uh, it's not alpha bet. Or the final one is uh, uh, the next one is not alpha bet. Then you return false. So this is uh, this is uh, this rule. Okay, and finally, uh, you need to check whether it's alpha. Uh, okay, so the, there is a final one that if it's alpha bet, but it's not lower, right? So this is it's alpha bet. Alphabet, but not lowercase. So basically, you can combine the first one, and then finally, uh, and then finally, that uh, there is a count that there is a thing I didn't do it. I should count hyphen, right? If so, if the number of hyphen is greater or equal to one, then as greater than one, then it violate uh violate this rule because at most one hyphen. Okay, then you just return true. Okay, so that's it. A very stupid problem that I tried multiple times and I didn't. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay, so uh, see you guys uh, next videos.